Hi, my name is Ali Maxwell. I work for the Environment Agency as a project officer for the River Avon Restoration Project. The River Nada here at Herdcots and throughout the catchment has been heavily modified throughout history for milling purposes, for water meadow creation, and more recently for flood defence and land drainage purposes. And this involved dredging the rivers, removing gravels within the channel and creating raised embankments. This is the, the start of the project reach at Herdcott House on the River Nada. It flows down here, we've got relatively high banks. The river did overtop this winter quite a numerous times and during the high flows a lot of sediment dropped out into the river banks. This is what we're trying to achieve through some of the works we delivered. And you can actually see down here in the, in the soft silts water vole footprints. So it's a good sign that they've come back to the river soon after the project was uh, completed. I'm George Stevenson. I am the owner here of Herdcote Estate and very fortunate to have this section of the River Nada flowing through our property. About two years ago, I was approached by the Environment Agency with a view to changing things around a bit. So the Environment Agency, chaired as it were by Ali Maxwell, came up with this idea of narrowing the river in sections, lowering the banks, creating flows, putting in gravel, and effectively making the river much more interesting. There were a lot of trees felled as part of this project. Um, this is where that type of work started. You can see the, uh, the stump remains of the, the tree that was felled. The, the tree was then laid into the river. The idea of that was to help narrow the channel, to uh, collect sediment and start the formation of berms. Also to provide habitat for uh, fish fry and refuge for fish. We can also see on the far bank where we started lowering the embankments. We started here and went on for about four or five hundred metres. The idea there was to allow the river and floodplain to connect more naturally during the high flows. As you can see, the works and the river progress further downstream on both sides. We have the woody debris on the right hand side and the embankment lowering on the left. We try to provide as much variety within the banks as we could to provide more habitat, more, more features. The embankment works carried on for best part of 400 metres, which gives the river and the floodplain much better connection than previous. It was done timely and with fairly precision skill from the, the operators from the Environment Agency who um, did the works. So.